Good morning, everybody. Today we will uh, conduct the exercise on profile labeling using the auto label equipment. And here the equipment to be used uh, in this exercise is auto label. We will require the staff as well as the tape. Measuring tape of about 30 meter length or 50 meter. You see that the principle of this exercise is to perform the profile labeling just to find out the profile of any linear object. And very common linear object we were surveying is a road. Suppose we have got a road, we have to find out the relative elevation of different points of that road. What we will do? We will put our equipment here, auto level equipment here, and then we will find out the label by citing the different points. What we will do? We will keep our staff over here and then we will find out the label here and then along the length of the road we will identify the sections at a specified length. It may be 10 meter or 20 meter depending upon how many points you want to take. And now at every interval from the same location of the label we will take sightings. So like you can say it is site number 1, 2, 3, 4. This is one back side and the other one will be the fourth side. And now again, since we know that now if we cite another point by the same level position, it will be difficult to cite. We will chip the instrument and now we will go on citing it. So as you all know from the principle of surveying, the last site for this point will be the fourth site. Again from the station number 2, we will do again citing for this, it will be back side. So that will be the principle of this uh, exercise and you will do the Recording of labels just in your usual manner. Serial number, you have to take back side, then intermediate sides, then four sides, and then you can calculate it by uh, the size and fall method or the height instrument method. The final result, whatever we get, you will have to plot it in the curve just by keeping the distance of the road length on the x axis and the RL or the heights on the Y axis. So at this particular position, whatever is the RL, at this position, whatever level, so you will get a curve. So this will be a profile of the road. Of course, just to have a vertical adjacination, I have made it zigzag. The line of a road may be smooth, but it will tell us that how the slopes on the road are varying. 